on a Sunday afternoon. I barely woken up when my phone goes off. I stumble to the other room where I left it. It's this girl I know. More of an acquaintance than a friend. I think she's pretty cool though. She says, look, I don't know if you're busy, and I know we've never really hung out, but I'd appreciate your company if you happen to be about to see. Everything is just shit right now. Instead of moping about your doors, I wonder if you fancy helping me tag some walls. Wear dark clothes. I'll lend you a hoodie and some gloves. Oh, and don't forget to wear your trainers in case we have to run off. So I meet her at the underpass. The same one where the council blasted off a last display in the three before that. We face the wall spray hands in hand, ready for combat. She takes her stencil to the surface, steps back and prepares for attack, swoops and takes down one brick at a time. I peel back the acetate to reveal clean lines, resembling those written by a naughty school kid in dry white pen. I will not spray paint on this wall again. I will not spray paint on this wall again. I will not spray paint on this wall again. Part two. Now I'm a big ball of adrenaline, swooning over my new heroine, witnessing her redefine the notion of all that's feminine. She's a work of art in motion. A vision in rotoscope, like a scanner darkly, and I'm crushing on her as she's crushing the patriarchy. And I'm not sure if it's the paint fumes or the butterflies, but I'm struggling to get my breath back. She passes me her paint can, tells me to finish off where she left her. Part three. A week has now passed, and my high is continuing on an upward spiral. And our little act of vandalism has since gone viral. And various theories concerning our identities have been reported. And we just play along because we don't want to get deported. And yet I feel a combination of smugness and frustration when my newsfeed is littered with pictures of our reclaimed walls, accompanied by captions stating, I don't know who these blokes are, but damn, they've got some balls. Thank you very much. <laughs>